Hello, Rob Lambert with Asset Protection Training. Last night I had the honor to have dinner with an old friend, Carlo Mason. He's general counsel of the Corporate Services Division of Belize Bank. He's also a good guy, knows a lot about Belize, and he uh, sat down at my kitchen table and we got out our cell phones and we made a really poor quality video that's still worth watching. I want you to just take four minutes, meet Carlo. It'll help you. It's, it's worth it. Here we go. Well, thank you very much, Ron. My name is Carlo Mason. I am the in-house counsel and actually business development manager for the corporate services division of the Belize Bank, which is the largest domestic bank in the country of Belize, but also is the largest international bank in the international financial services industry of Belize. Carla, I want to know who are you looking for? Do you have to be a millionaire? Do you have to have a million dollars of cash? What's your minimum for a good deposit for you? And what are you looking for from people? We're looking for people who want a bank with a stable bank, who want services from a secure bank. That's us. Our minimum to open an account is simply 1,000 US dollars. My Lord, that's very, very small. How long does it take to open an account at Bank, bank of Belize? I always call it Belize Bank. It is Belize and Bank. Some people call it Royal Caribbean. I'm not sure what the relationship is. Okay, let me quickly explain that. What you have is BCB Holdings Limited, which is a London Stock Exchange listed company. And it owns the Belize Bank Limited, which services the domestic economy for the country of Belize. It also owns the corporate services division and also owns what's called British Caribbean Bank International Limited. That company, British Caribbean Bank International Limited, is the bank which services your clients. Okay, Carlo, I'm gonna, I'm, in order to keep this short, and you know we'll be doing longer videos, to go over the opening process. Sure. But just to keep this short, I'm going to ask you a few just simple questions. Uh, how long does it take to open an account? Assuming somebody has all the paperwork, references, you need an ut original utility bill, original utility. you need a letter from an accountant or a lawyer, yes. you need a letter from their bank, it can just be a normal to whom it may concern. Yes. Joe Blow has been a decent customer for the two years. The banks have standard yeah. wording. And they don't really say anything, they're no. just a letter from a bank. No. Yeah, um, how long does it take to open an account? What type of process should somebody expect? And what type of support should they expect from the bank? Based on the assumption that everything is together? Yes. Two days. Is there a person they can call? And I know that's not you. You're the general counsel of the bank and you're in court half the I time when I call you. I would say, do? Rob, that they can't call me, but if they want to go directly to the source, they could call Imogene Lopez, who's a customer service manager for the bank, and she will either personally attend to the issue or she'll assign it to one of her team who has to answer to her. Okay, so but, there, is, there is a feedback loop. Of course. There, you know, people get pretty frustrated dealing with banks. That's uh, true. That's true. And I, I'll acknowledge that. Yeah. And, and one last question. Is Belize the happiest place on earth? It is for me. And I think it would be for a number of people who decide to either come there and spend time there or come and make use of the services that we offer. So your bank guarantees to make the happiest customers on earth. My bank likes to see a lot of teeth. <laughs> Great. Perfect.